You wanted the best, but you got the best. The hottest band in the world. Black Sabbath. Well, smack what we got up today is Black Sabbath Sunday, where I celebrate my favorite band on Sunday. And this week, Joe Hampson saved Black Sabbath Sunday. And let me tell you something. He just donated yesterday, and I had nothing planned for Black Sabbath Sunday this week. So I said, let me do this now. And that way I can put it up for Black Sabbath Sunday. And uh, it's uh, The Mob Rules, or Mob Rules. The song is called The Mob Rules, but the album's just called Mob Rules. Against Metallica's Master of Puppets, my all-time favorite Metallica album. But, I actually think Mob Rules is a better album. I do. I think it's the rule of uh, 1982, 1984 and down. It's always better. Uh, I mean, there's exceptions, but. In this case, uh, Mob Rules to me is extremely underrated. How Sign of the Southern Cross is not on the radio like Stairway to Heaven baffles me. You know, it's like the most classic song ever. It should be up there, you know, with Stay Away to Heaven and Stargazer doesn't get played either. But uh, that features a great Ronnie James Dio. And uh, it's just a monster album. I, I was lucky enough to see the Mob Rules tour at the Hollywood Sportatorium, and it was phenomenal. And then we got Metallica, Master of Puppets. Blew my mind. I was already a big... I've been a big Metallica fan, even... Before Kill 'Em All, I had Metal Massacre and uh, No Life to Leather, a uh, real crappy version on cassette. And, uh, you know, then I got into this and Ride the Lightning blew my mind. And this was like, oh my God, this is the, this is the to me, the ultimate Metallica album. Just because I like Mob Rules more doesn't mean squat at the awesomeness that is Master of Puppets. So let's do this for Joe Hampson. And again, thank you, Joe, for donating. And thank you for saving Black Sabbath Sunday for this week. So let's do this. All right, we got Battery versus Turn Up the Night. Yeah, Turn Up the Night's awesome, but I'm going to go with Battery on this one. Uh, definitely Battery. All right, next, Voodoo versus Master of Puppets. You know... I love Master of Puppets so much, but this is not hard for me. I really do think Voodoo is the better song, so I'm giving this one a Black Sabbath. All right, next, The Thing That Should Not Be versus Sign of the Southern Cross. I love the grinding heaviness of Thing That Should Not Be. I think it's amazing. It's an amazing tune. It's awesome, but sorry, no. No way, ho sway. Sign of the Southern Cross definitely wins this one. All right, next. Now, Joe asked me to combine E5150 with The Mob Rules, and that's going to go against Sanitarium. Now, I'd go with Sanitarium over E5150, but no. The Mob Rules, you know that song with the in it, wins. Definitely giving that one to Black Sabbath. All right, now we flip the album over and we got Country Girl versus Disposable Heroes. Now, this may be the toughest one for me. Oh, no, no, actually, maybe not. Uh, but I have to go with Disposable Heroes and it hurts a lot for me to say this because I absolutely love Country Girl. Such an amazing tune, but I got to go with Disposable Heroes. All right, next, uh, Slipping Away versus Leper Messiah. Uh, I love them both, but this one, I'm definitely going with Metallica on that one. Leper Messiah wins that. All right, this is the toughest one. This kills me. Falling Off the Edge of the World versus my all-time favorite Metallica song, Orion. This is the toughest, definitely the toughest. And it hurts for me to do this. I'm going Metallica. There's just something about Orion, man. It just blows my mind. All right, next, we got uh, Over and Over versus 
versus Damage Inc. I love Over and Over, one of my favorite guitar solos. I only goes ape shit at the end of this song. Love it. Damage Inc. wins. Forget that noise. That is one monster of a song that's hard to beat. Now look at that score. I mean, Metallica got double. And I still think Mob Rules is the better album because these tracks by tracks are luck of the draw. It doesn't really determine which album's better, at least not to me. Because in my world, Master of Puppet rules and Mob Rules over it. So, Joe Amson, thank you so much, buddy, for your Black Sabbath Sunday donation. And uh, look, I did it right at the nick of time because you sent the donation on Saturday. And here it is up on Sunday. And if you like to donate out there, I got a PayPal in the description below. And please subscribe to my channel if you have not. And uh, like the video. It's good for the YouTube, whatever that word is. Um, and uh, click the little bell for notifications. I got something up pretty much every day. So, and also a big awesome thank you to those who have already subscribed. I'm talking about all you people that did it from the beginning all the way till now. Thank you all. You all rule. You all are so awesome that I am speechless. I don't know what to say except awesome, because that's what you are. And uh, I know you all stay frosty, but everybody out there that's not so awesome, stay frosty, all right? And I know all you cool people listen to Black Sabbath, and so should you uncool people. And smack them a gob! Before we get canceled, check out the Rock and Metal Combat Podcast with me and Wadzilla. We are the Podcast Kings. Link to the podcast is in the description below and also a link to the YouTube page. Check out older episodes with visuals. And very soon, either Ian and I will learn how to go on YouTube live. Might be soon. So check out the greatest podcast ever according to science.com. It's also God's favorite podcast and Satan's favorite podcast as well. So check out the Rock and Metal Combat Podcast before we get canceled.